America was built on beer. A staple for thousands of years, our founding fathers even brewed it. Today, America has over 2,700 craft breweries, and they are making happiness in a glass. From mellow to massive, from hoppy to sweet, award-winning beers are being brewed across the country, and we taste them all coast to coast. The Great American Brew Trail is the first national craft TV beer show of its kind, and it delivers fun, food, and fermentation. Besides, who wouldn't want to sit back and have a beer with me? <laughs> My name is Amy Sherman. I'm a chef, I'm a mom, and I'm a beer drinker. Shocking, I know. That's right, I'm a girl who really likes beer. Out of the way, boys. What are we drinking? I mean, why wouldn't I drink beer? As a chef, I love the variety of local ingredients, and I appreciate what it takes to create a great beer. In fact, I've been a home brewer for years. All across the United States, microbreweries are popping up with plenty of atmosphere, plenty of local foods, and of course, plenty of beer. We'll see the ins and outs and the ups and downs behind the taps at some of the country's best microbreweries. So join me on the Great American Brew Trail as I taste my way across the USA, one pint at a time. I was raised up on Marvin Gaye. Mama made us go to church every Sunday. Detroit Beer Company is located right in the heart of downtown Detroit. Everybody says Detroit is dead. Everybody's wrong. Down by the schoolyard. Sitting on the banks of Lake St. Clair. Detroit, the Motor City, my city, where they make the cars that power the nation and pour the steel that kept me awake at night in my bedroom. Now they pour legendary beers, like here at the Detroit Beer Company. I'm hoping I can go inside and learn more about the legendary Detroit Red Dwarf. Please take me back to the day. Take me back to Detroit, Michigan. That's where my heart will always be. have a beer philosophy that you kind of abide by when you're brewing beer here? I've got a pretty loose philosophy, I'd say. I go for more traditional styles, and I might do a little experimentation with those, but kind of keep it When you traditional. say traditional, do you mean more a German influence, or...? Um, I like uh, beers, I guess, from the world, any place. Mm -hmm. Be it uh, German, English, uh, Belgian. Uh, and I kind of kind of I stick to the, um, the traditional recipes. Want a light beer before a home game? Broadway Light might be the local way to go. I really enjoy the Broadway Light. Um, it's very, it's just very simple, non-complex. You know, it doesn't assault uh, any of the taste buds. It's a nice, smooth, crisp taste. Um, you know, I love the beer. I love the, the people working behind the bar, and the food is fantastic. I get to eat plenty of great food on the trail, but for once, I get to have a salad. My TV body thanks you, Detroit Beer Company. I'm here in the kitchen at Detroit Beer Company with head chef Reginald. You make everything from scratch in this kitchen. Yeah. Everything. Yeah. <laughs> that is the that's the theme here, and they want to keep that with that with fresh Michigan beer and to go with that fresh uh, homemade food. Everything's made from scratch. Mmm, it's kind of sweet, but then you get the lime taste, mm -hmm. and the cilantro is not overpowering at all. Right. That's a really great. Fresh salad. Let's try it with the Rattler. That's a perfect pairing in my book. I came back to Michigan and I was kind of shocked because I had missed the beer scene for about six or seven years. And when I got back, just how how big it had grown and what it had become. It's pretty impressive. And you must be pretty proud to be a part of it. Absolutely. Absolutely. It's pretty fantastic. I love Michigan. Union mandated break, local 1529. On the Great American Brew Show, we take you behind the taps at some of the country's best microbreweries, where you get to meet the characters, I mean brewers, whose passion and creativity are fueling this American craft beer boom. 
every brewery has a really unique story. And paired with amazing food and incredible beers, this is a journey that you don't want to miss. So join me on the Great American Brew Trail as I taste my way across the USA, one pint at a time. Oh, oh, oh.